heirs to the land of promise. Remember, every trumpet sounded under the sixth seal, only then when it sounded. Notice, now, exactly the continuity of the Scripture is exactly the same. Under the seventh trumpet is to Israel the same as the seventh seal was to the church. We find under the seventh seal that when these souls that was under the altar there that received robes, they were given robes. Not that they earned them because they were in the dispensation when God was still dealing with grace with the Gentiles, not Jews. Israel is saved as a nation. God deals with Israel as a nation. Gentiles is a people for His name. Not a nation for His name. Israel. And when Hitler and them persecuted the Jews and did the things that they'd done, under that, look, they, Stalin, Hitler, and all those dictators raised up if we had the time which to rehearse it to some newcomers, but we went through it under that same age that there has been in Germany and, and all the other nations. Jews have scattered throughout all the land, but there has raised and They'll know it. They'll hear it. Notice the loosing of this ecclesiastical spirit. Now, 20 years later, at that war, we see the loosing of the ecclesiastical spirit. What on earth? The seventh seal. The seventh trumpet to the Jew. Look at the moon darkening out. We're under. Not be broken. The big 50 days has passed over. The Pentecostal feast has passed over. Seven Sabbaths. Until the trumpets, a type of the seventh church age. Remember it. Remember, the se- under the sixth trumpet, the Jew... Out- Are you listening? Under the sixth trumpet, the, the Pentecostals reject the Bible. The, the Luke... War- not only Pentecostals, all the rest. The church world rejects Christ and He's put on the outside. And in the same trumpet and the same seal, rather, when it was open. To show Jesus on the outside of the church, trying to get back in. At the same time, the trumpet sound for the Jews, and the Jews recognize the atonement. Glory! Hallelujah! Oh my! And then the stage of the reformers, and now the calling out time. When finished at latest, seeing age according to Revelation 10, the mystery of all the Bible would be known to the bride. Is that right? Revelation 10, listen close now. <laughs> bride called out by the Word, Christ Himself calling out the bride, making plain Hebrews 13, 8, that He's the same yesterday and forever, does the same, is the same. He that believeth on me, the works that I do, shall he do also. See? Luke, 22, uh, Luke 17, 30, and also Malachi 4, Hebrews 4, all these scriptures is promised. This is to be between the sixth and the seventh seal and the sixth and the seventh trumpet. Pentecost, feast, Finishes at the period of the seventh trumpet for the next is the coming of a uh, seventh tr- uh, seal for the next is the mystery of the coming of Christ. And also the trumpet is sound for the Jews. Their sixth trumpet is sound. And when it does, it makes known to them the revealed Son of God. Amen. One half our spirits. Remember, all trumpets sound on the sixth seal. The sixth seal finishes a mystery under the sixth seal just before the seventh open. Notice, here's Leviticus 23 and 26, how in all Lord, the Scripture. And at the same time, now as soon as this uh, church, the bride is drawn together, she's taken up in that mystery of the seventh seal, or the seventh seal, the mystery going, and the Jews is called by the mystery of the seventh trumpet, which is two prophets, Elijah and Moses. And they come back, and there's where the Pentecostals is all mixed up. They're looking for something to happen. The church is done gone, and that's to the Jews. Exactly. To call all, call them out of the denominations and traditions. Now we see the church of Pentecost age is finished. The bride must step out of the way to go up now. So the two servants, the two servants of God in Revelations, the two prophets, can appear upon the scene to Sound the seventh trumpet to them. Make known to them the Christ. 